everyone, it's Alexandria and Michael and welcome to Never Better Club. Today we're taking on Fonzie's Insane Roulette Challenge. Six chocolate bullets. All right, so today we're taking on a new challenge from League of Fire. It is going to be interesting. So let's open the box and get right into it. I have never done this before and neither has Michael. So this is pretty neat. It is a roulette challenge, like Russian roulette, I suppose, but uh, with bullets that are made of chocolate. So I'm just going to remove this and I'll show you what's in the box here. These are the bullets. They are numbered one through six. So it's a graduating heat scale on these bullets. Uh, the first one is the most mild from my understanding. And then um, it goes, well, now I'm second guessing because it's Russian roulette. So I don't know that we know how hot each bullet is gonna be. Perhaps there's a little bit of mystery there. Yeah, um, you, you'd think it'd be pretty random. Yeah, I, I hope so. Um, the reading the instructions, it gave me the feeling that they were going to be graduating, but that doesn't really make sense given the title or the name of the challenge. So yeah. Sticker. Oh, cool. We've got cards. Hey, it's Katie. Beyond Seattle Eats. Hi, Katie. I have plenty of your cards. No, I think I, I have don't. everyone's cards. Who'd you get? Michael has... Sorry, I can't read. It's dark in here. Kem. Kem Dervish. Do we have that one? I don't think we do. I don't know. Yeah. We are not familiar with you, friend. All right, so let's get into the rules here. Oh, there's some rules here in the box yeah. as well. So it comes with a League of Fire card, a Fonzie's Insane Hot Sauce sticker, and then the rules. Um, I'll move my box to the side here. And uh, we can just, I guess we can read the rules from here. Would you like me to read them from here or the League of Fire website? Um, yeah, as long as they're the same. All right. So the rules, the Fonzie's Insane Roulette Tube contains six bullets. The challenge is to eat the six bullets, obviously, because what else would you do with them? Uh, you start with bullet number one and then eat in a clockwise direction until you have eaten bullet number six. So you have to um, keep going there and uh, it says each bullet must be chewed at least 10 times before being swallowed. And after each bullet, you must wait at least one minute before you can start with the next bullet. So we'll just time that chew 10 times or more, um, start a timer for a minute, and then you rinse, repeat. No eating or drinking is allowed during the challenge. And I saw on the League of Fire website, they added a new rule, which is no eating, drinking, vaping, or relief of any kind, including taking medication. Thought that was very interesting. Hmm. So no, no numbing your mouth. <laughs> so chew for two times. We won't times, be doing that. <laughs> uh, wait at least one minute. And then once we finish, it's a three minute afterburn. After the last bullet, you must wait three minutes. Yes. I've been interested to, in that, that's what you saw. Listed. That's exactly what I saw. Yeah. That's um, the, the, the shorter form of it. And of course, because this is a League of Fire challenge, we must um, read our short disclaimer. Uh, would you like to go first, Michael? Um, or I can go first if you prefer. I, Alexandria Tursek, am over 18 years of age of sound mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstance be held responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this without question. All right, I'm Michael Morgan. I'm over 18 years of age. I'm still in line. I have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept the League of Fire. Their suppliers and manufacturers will, under no circumstances, be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question. I have not mentioned my Dead Heat shirt. It is fantastic and it fits me so nicely. So we will put the link below. If you would like to purchase a Dead Heat collective shirt, it is not our brand, it is our friend. Sundance's brand, check out his YouTube channel and check out his merchandise and apparel line. Michael has an awesome bandana, I don't know if he can reach it, uh, that he bought because as you may or may not know, he's a sweater. I am. By the way, if you don't know that, you're probably not a subscriber. Please subscribe to our channel. We appreciate all of you. Please like this video and uh, share this video with a friend. We are, uh, we love hot food, we love spicy things, peppers, challenges, you name it. Um, so we're here to burn for you and you can just watch us. 
All right, right, let's get into it. Yeah, I know. Let's, let's do it. it. I'm excited too. I, this is different. I have not seen anyone do this. I know other people have, but it's, this is a brand new challenge. So, okay, number one, and make sure you go clockwise. Do not forget where you started. All right. Okay, how do we open this? Oh, there's a little cap here. Lovely. Clockwise. I'm very appreciative of them. Yeah, so it's like you start at 6 p.m. and then you work your way. So number okay. one, and then go clockwise. Yeah? Okay, cool. So I wonder, are they all random or are they all going to hit at different... They should be all random, you right? So, like, yeah. I could get the hottest one right now. Right. Look, it's a little chocolate bullet. How cute. Or I could get the mildest one. And you won't know because yep. you have no context. All right, so we're going to This is it. fun. Yeah, chew for two ten times, and then we'll start the timer. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Not hot. Mine. I'm certain that was 10 times. Mine was hot. Oh, you got a hot one? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> really? Yeah, that was, that was you're definitely... You're a little pink. Yeah, oh, that was... you're really pink. Yeah, cool. there was some heat to that. There was, there was Reaper or you something. You guys, this is a fun challenge. Okay, I have a little tingle in the back of my throat. It wasn't like there was nothing, but... No, that um, was... Yeah. Well, that I, was have a, hot one. I have a feeling, judging by Michael's flush skin tone, that we um, will get some hot ones in here. Cool. This is cool. This is fun. All right, back to my shirt because it matters. I never can find cute t-shirts that actually fit me. I feel like a lot of them are always, they always end up being super baggy and they come, this is an extra small, which is hard to find, at least for me, with cool t-shirt brands. So thanks for making extra smalls, Sundance, or uh, providing them. Anyways, love the font, love the fit. I woke up today and I put it on and I was like, wow, today's going to be a great day. Sorry, I got a hair on my finger. Get out of here. All right, number two, hurry, Michael, hurry. I'm burning up here. I got to get it out. Whew. You know, I felt it a little bit. It was building. What kind of chocolate is this? You know, you know. Like mm -hmm. chocolate? Yeah, it's not. Yeah, but. Ah, <clears throat> uh, yeah. I suppose we should say ah. Uh, uh, yeah, that was, that was mild for me. Oh, that one was mild for me, too. I'm just getting all the mild ones up front. I'm going to get the next one. Oh, no, that tasted like. Uh-oh, maybe I'm wrong. <clears throat> oh, I tasted Reaper in that one, though. Powder. So we, are there no ingredients listed on our, well, there are. Three here, we go, here we go with my poor vision again. Ingredients. Uh, I cannot see. Let me see. Oh, man. <gasps> well, that's in a different language. Let's see. Oh. It's the, it's the <laughs> that's why one. I can't. I just couldn't make uh, anything cocoa, out. Sugar, cocoa butter, so Carolina sad. Reaper powder. Okay, there. Whole milk powder. Natural vanilla flavoring. Oh, there's, so soy, it's Reaper. there's soy and milk powder. You know that Reaper smell taste? It gets up in your nose. It's not so pleasant. It actually makes your stomach feel a little weird. I probably got a hot one there and I didn't know it. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. I wonder if any of them have no powder. Hmm. You know, they're just solid chocolate. <clears throat> ah. 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 <clears throat> okay, that one was hot. You know, <coughs> not. Powder. It's not killing me, but the powder. Oh, what's it reminding me of? I'm starting to get that physical reaction from it. Um, okay, let me blow my nose. Gosh, what challenge am I thinking of? Chocolate Reaper powder, Michael. Not the, well, probably. What does it taste like to you? Insanity. A little like the Insanity Skulls, but Insanity Skulls chocolate is very premium. This tastes like something else. 
Oh, I think I, that was a hot one I just ate. Uh, I'm feeling it. It's definitely not a half pound of chocolate, so that's a lot easier. Yeah, but once <laughs> you do those crazy challenges where you eat like a half pound of rebar chocolate, um, it like permanently kind of messes with your head when you taste that thing. Oopsie, taste. Cheers. Bullet number four. Cheers. Mm. Ah. Ah. Uh, it's definitely fun. I'm trying to absorb it. I wish there was more roulette style challenges because you just have no idea what you're getting yourself into. Uh, it's definitely been pretty, pretty wild. I feel like they're graduating for me. Do you not feel that way at all? The first one I had was definitely, but you know, now I think about it. But it's building too. Like you're it, it probably, a reaper powder. So there's nothing in here that fixes this. I bet you it, it, it's turn around in transit. No way. Yeah, no, look, it just it just spins. So, yeah, I think I started off with one of the hotter ones. I didn't. Uh. Yeah, there's there's some heat to this for sure. It's a fun challenge. I like the graduating Wait. challenges in general. It's just kind of neat to work your way up. And, of course, this time I feel like I'm going the opposite, so. Yeah. All right. Cheers. Cheers. See, some are hollow and some aren't. Have you noticed that? Interesting. Mmm. I get it now. I think I understand. Mm. If there's no actual ah um, uh, powder in these, but I think that, like, like when I say there's no powder, I'm not. I'm trying to say they're not stuffed with powder. I think the chocolate itself is reaper chocolate. Oh. And the hollow ones are less hot because there's less chocolate. That makes sense to me. Maybe I'm wrong. Ugh. I got a little bit of sweat. So yeah, no, it's I hot. I always know it's hot when I start sweating, so there's no faking it. I'm not saying I enjoy this challenge. I'm not. I, I'm, I really, it's, it's, um, there's something funny about it. I, I think it's kind of a fun challenge. Yeah, I think no, this is it's just a, a fairly, sugar in my stomach. <laughs> I don't know. Fairly entry level. It's not a lot of food. Uh, yeah, that's um, a good part about it's it. It's not a ton of spice. Oh, that's um, better. I maybe not burp. the first League of Fire challenge you'd want to do, but... Yeah, maybe yeah, not. Maybe the second or third. Cheers. Oh, excuse me. Last bullet. Oops. Three minutes. Yep. All right. Okay. That was, uh, it was interesting. It was hot. Yeah, there's it was hotter some than, I, it. than I thought it was going to be. Because <sighs> this is a three point challenge, right? Three. Three points, yeah. <clears throat> I might have given this maybe four points. Yeah, maybe. A little hotter than that. I think there are a lot of, there aren't many three point League of Fire challenges. It's that Reaper powder. Powder challenges, I find, are typically more difficult than non powder challenges. Whether it's the, um, what's it called? The crunchy one or um, any of the chocolate challenges that have you know just like this one powder in the in the chocolate right they they seem to be a little trickier not trickier they get to your stomach though yeah powder for sure yeah, uh, a little bit of sweat 
I find it an, an annoying burden. I'm not enjoying it. Definitely a challenge. Yeah. Like, Fonzie. I'm saliva salivating a lot. Fonzie's insane hot sauce challenge. Roulette. Roulette. No, this is hot sauce. Cool. <sighs> well, what's going on with you, Michael? Well, we're continuing to um, train for our San Diego pepper eating competition, which is in June. It's crazy to think that that is right around the corner. Maybe this last one was the hottest one I got. Yeah, maybe you got a more progressive. Mine was a little different. Yeah. I think it maybe got, as I said, kind of spun around. Yeah, my first trans. one um, was not that hot. Yes, training. That we are. So we have some super hots on the way, and we have some videos we're looking forward to putting together just eating some Reapers, some fresh Carolina Reapers. I love fresh peppers. Oh, man. Yeah, if you haven't done so already, please like this video. And feel free, if there's a challenge you have not seen us already do, go ahead and leave a comment. We love reading through our comments and we love suggestions from our viewers. I'm always looking at new peppers to eat. I love uh, um, any type of challenge. It doesn't have to be League of Fire, so. List it below. This is really an interesting mouth heat. It is. I hate it's it. Not, it's not crazy. It's oh, just, it's challenging though. Yeah, this is definitely a burn. So, oh. this is a hot one. Yeah. It's a, it's like a itchy burn. We actually ordered this directly from Leo Fire, uh, LeoFire.com. Um, I was very impressed actually with their shipping. So we live in the Midwest. And in the United States. In the United States. And we ordered on Sunday. We It arrived on a Thursday. So I thought that was pretty impressive. That was great. Wow. Thank you guys so much for watching. And we hope you stick around and stay tuned for our new and upcoming challenges that we have uh, later this week. Yep. Like a fire is putting out all sorts of new challenges and some old ones we've been able to get our hands on. So. Yes. We have some, some new challenges to us, at least, so we're looking forward to it. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to go now. All right. <laughs> well, thank you so much for watching, and have a great day. Bye, everyone.